coming. Oh. Ouch. Look at that. Oh. Disaster strikes right there. Hello there, my friends. Welcome back to Surviving Mars, where we are continuing off right where we left off. We were building this water facility. Now that we have run out of our water source right here, we ha are digging up all the cabling and stuff so that we have space enough to be able to set up a water reclamation farm. Kind of like a moisture vaporator farm from Star Wars. So, while we get that set up, we will try to accomplish a lot of things today. Hopefully we can get atmosphere, a little bit more atmosphere here, and we will be able to start digging through deeper technology and try to get just pushing the game along and see what happens. As you saw in the intro, there is a disaster that's going to hit us, and the question is, is will we survive? Is this going to be the last episode or not? Let's find out as we work our way through this episode. So, we are getting the water set up and just setting up the pipes and the wiring for that. It's not a huge deal, and but at least we've, we're getting some of the water going. We really do need this as soon as possible because, as you can tell right now, we are losing water at the rate of 10 per whatever, I think it's like per hour within the game, so hourly soul. And, uh, yeah, so if we can reduce that down to a minimum, we are going to be golden. And it will be helpful to e eventually eradicate the whole need for the wa uh, water, but I think part of this is caused by that lake we installed. And I should have probably just turned off the lake, but I didn't... Just trying to get some of the infrastructure s set up in this area before we go and try to adjust and see if we can't, like, try to keep that lake open or... I don't know. Let's look at this. The lake is just 24% full, and all the other lakes look like they're not using that much water. So we should be able to... Yeah, well, let's turn off fuel at night, see if we can't reduce our loss. And I still feel like we're in trouble. The... Yep, the uh, dust storm doesn't really seem to be helping much. Totally awesome. We've got a broken dome. Uh -huh. uh, let's sacrifice... Let's sacrifice the vol vo some volunteers. Sadly, that they'll perish, but it saves the dome. Yeah, I guess that's what we're going to do. So, the new fractures cease to grow. Okay. And the existing fractures need, uh, will be fixed by the automatically by the drums. So that's that's nice. We saved the dome. I remember a play a while ago that I did, and I chose not to send people out, and it was a bad enough situation that fractures got worse, and I had huge amounts of problems throughout the entire, like, hour after that. And I wonder if I even... I think I lost that game. It's possible that I lost that game altogether. But let's get more of this infrastructure set up, our moisture vaporator farm here, and... This, it, I think we have enough prefabs to actually make this work really well. <clears throat> Although we are at negative 26 still. Oh, it's because we're not producing. That, I keep forgetting that. So let's see here. Oh, um, we should get a scrubber in this area. Just so that we can keep these guys all clean okay and that should cover it all good so a few souls have passed i got the got us past the dust storm there's just little knickknacks that i was supposed to do and tiny little leaks that kept causing problems we now have the carbonate processor available for us which allows us to start pumping more atmosphere into the air of mars we need to get a couple of those down and I think this spot right here is going to be a great spot for that. So let me just grab the carbonate processor. And I think if we put one right over here, actually, I would like to set this up so that we can have 
a waste rock center to this because these carbonate processors actually burn waste rock, which is really nice because it helps us get rid of the waste rock. And so I'm going to place one here and we'll put the dumping site right there in front of it. And then we can place the other one and they'll be properly spaced and they'll look really good. See, doesn't that look good? Excellent. Okay, we are just a few more days down the road and the progress on these is going slow. And I think I've discovered the reason. We're going to pause this one because I noticed that we were running out of power, uh, not power, but uh, metals. And we are having troubles over here. If these, if either of these guys break, we are doomed. Like, we will no longer have air for our peoples here. And so, looking around the map, it looks like we've got some hot spots, but they're all deep metals. And that's not going to work out well for us right off the top. We need some metals fast. We could build a outpost over here, but it would be just an outpost solely for well, really not much. Uh, I like this area, and we are currently researching deep metal extraction, so I think we'll be okay if we can get this one done as soon as possible. So turning this off definitely will help. Uh, let's set the oxygen guys to be max priority. That could help. And let's get going. So I'm going to speed it up so that we can get through some things. I want to know potentially like what's here, here, and here. If we get some more metals, it might give us more of a location. But let's get our commander Sector down there. And discovered. in the meantime, let's, let's see here. There's some metals here. And we've collected just about everything up there. There's not a lot of metals right there. And, oh, that looks like a hot spot. Let's do... Let's collect a, as much of this as possible. Ah. Is there a way? Yes. Hey, look at that. We can get all that. Let's collect all that and get him going. We got a breakthrough. Rapid sleep. Ooh, this will be nice. Oy, yay. That costs a lot. We'll have to do that one very soon because that will help our peoples be a lot happier. And... They will actually enjoy working at night, which will give us more production, which works everything out. It it all adds on top. So, he's here somewhere. Look at that. There he is. Yeah, once he gets dusty, he's pretty hard to find. But, that aside, let's experimental rocket. Luckily, our rockets are safe now. Apparently, there was a problem. Let's make sure that we don't lose any more rockets. We need... We would love for this to be producing more, but we can't do any more than that. And our drones are dutifully doing their job, getting things moving. Looks like they're dedicating all of this to that. Let's pause that for now. And we'll get... Metals spread around until we have at least 20 metals. We're going to hold that still. I really would like to get the atmosphere moving, but really, if we can't do it, we can't do it. So we ought to see if we can put something right there. Uh, let's get the research rolling, see if we can figure out what that is. And let's build a drone hub to encompass all of this. That looks like an excellent spot and we can get all the concrete. Okay. So now as we complete this, we will be able to get rolling. We've got 53 uh, metals. Let's get our atmosphere rolling. That'll, that'll be nice. This one will let wait until we start showing a positive gain. Hey, look at that. We're already starting to go up in atmosphere. Temperature. Still working its slow way up. And we've got 29 left. We could finish this. Oh, no, we can't. And hopefully that gives us enough diversion that we are directing 
Hey, look at these. We've got these. Let's get those helping each other. We almost lost them. Cool. Those are helping each other. These are getting cleaned and they are being maintained. <sighs> Deep metals. Hey, look at that. Okay, so now we should, in theory, be able to place this so that it can take advantage of deep metals. Sweet! What I would really like to see us do before the end of this episode is I would like to be able to build a larger dome. If we can build the larger domes, which I think is in the engineering tier, so I've been kind of lacking on this section, I think that's where the domes are. And if that is the case, then we are in deep trouble because we need... We definitely need to push this one a lot. That's why I brought this fuel consumption up. And I guess we can work on the low G high rise. And hopefully that will work. I don't know. Smart home. Ooh, let's do that. Mm -hmm. This will provide high quality, enjoyable living. And it looks really cool. We have alternate setups that we can do. In just using the brackets next to P, I can change the building type and let us select before we place it. We should be able to change between building. Oh, we are changing between buildings. So, we can do a variety of things. I like that. It kind of looks cozy. Let's do that. How is it? <gasps> nice! We don't even need that. Oh, we need this if we amplify sweet okay and since we're doing metals down here for the most part we are going to need a deposit for metals let's do a few of them we can just put that right there and we'll put its neighbor right here as well and this we need to zoom down this we need to zoom down Sweet. We've got our outpost running. Doing almost well on water. Holy cow, we are using water up fast. Eight hours. Oh, I thought we were using it up too fast. I need more water storage. Yeah, that's why we're doing this one. Hmm. Do -do -do -do. How are we doing on our research? We got through a couple of things really fast. Which means we were able to... Hey, look at that! We can do the electronics factory! That's exactly what we need. And... Into dome by... Oh, yeah. That, that'll work. Okay. So we'll work these ones. This is full. And it's actually Research contributing to the complete. water. Let's open up the farms. We've got lots of food. But that really could change any time. I wouldn't be surprised if we start having troubles with food. That's not good. I don't want... Oh, boy. Okay, so this is not a bad one. They want to test a bomb. Huh. And I guess let's do it. Uh, this is going to cost some damage, so let's do that. Oh, an enormous blast of 500 megatons. Yikes. Meteor oh, incoming. Oh. Ouch. Look at that. Oh. Disaster strikes right there. Oh. Darn. Oh. Okay. Yep. That's our lot. <gasps> Oh, it's a meteor storm! We will have to deal with this. So it would appear that our wonderful bomb has caused a dust storm before we even refill with water. <laughs> it has caused a meteor storm, which is coming in right now. And <laughs> we have no idea where it's going to go. Its first meteor impact was incoming. right on top of that. Oh... This is just beautiful. It's like the game hates us. Let's see if we can survive this. So we'll set this to fast and we'll just see what happens. But hey, look, we got some polymers. We just lost two rovers. They're squished flat. Totally. 
One of them was carrying medals. Oh, that's just awesome. Oh. Anomaly analyzed. Come on. Rebuild. <laughs> Oof. Meteor incoming. Yikes! Look at this. Look at this. Ladies and gentlemen, if we die from this, we will have lost the game. <laughs> oh. Do we have MDS later lasers? Hang on. Oh. We have lasers! Sweet! Oh, we can set those up. I don't think we can build them in time. But at least we can potentially reduce the chances of losing everything. Oh, bugger. Let's put one right there and just try to cover the base in general. Oh. Okay, okay. Awful, awful, awful. We'll need to put one out here. Cover that area. And we definitely need one protecting this dome. Oh, I didn't even know we had MDS lasers. Meteor incoming. <sighs> There's no life support Meteor out there. Incoming. Okay, well, that's perfectly fine. There's no life support in a lot of places. How are we doing? Where are... Sweet. Oh. Those are being built fast. Meteor incoming. So this one... Check it out. This, this hopefully will be... Oh. Well. Hey, look at that! <laughs> We've got more problems. Um, sure, we'll probably lose. You have gained several building prefabs. Yes. Okay. Did you see the laser shoot? Let's see if it can. Yes. Ha 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 ha. We have defended the base. Meteor incoming. Oh, let's get one more out here. We need one more. Let's get it protecting right there. Meteor incoming. Oxygen. We have no oxygen. Oxygen. Uh, stored oxygen. We have 28 oxygen Resources left. Resources are low. Oh my. Again, like, the game might have killed us. This has been a really fun game to play, guys. Uh, this, this, game, this level has been Sector challenging. Scan. It's been really, really trying to hurt us. And let's see, we've got 11 hours left and no oxygen. Yeah. We are totally empty. So people are going to be dying. I don't even know what we've got here. We've got destroyed rovers. We've got leaks all over the place. We've got three fractures in that building. That building is practically toast. We've got all of the buildings without... St Shot down a meteorite. Sweet. Meteor incoming. Cycle through them. That one will probably get destroyed. Here we go. Zap. Oh, no, yeah. No zaps. We lost all sorts of food. Do we, we don't... We've got really unhappy people that are just totally oxygen deprived. Two hours left in the dust storm, and then we will provide oxygen again. Here we go. Here we go. How many people have we lost? It doesn't say we've lost anybody. Meteor incoming. I'm really impressed. We haven't lost anybody. And we've restored oxygen. That's awesome. Anomaly found. Guys, I don't know if we've done it, but we might have survived this catastrophe. And we got quite a bit of money. Holy cow, five billion. That's nice. Can't complain about that. Yeah. Well. Yikes. That was a really rough strand. Yeah, you're ready to land. Let's get you back. We need the medics. Oh. 
Come on. We have no polymers. <laughs> oh. Some iron right there. That's nice. Okay, so we need to get more polymers. We've got a drone prefab. That's nice. We've got one power plant prefab. And I don't see any more prefabs. Eh, we'll take what we can get. Oh. Was this the expedition? Gathering ex. Okay. No fuel. Do we have... Oh. Do we have fuel yet? Anomaly found. Can we make more fuel? We've got one water. Um, we can't make the fuel yet. I don't even know where I'm trying to look, guys. I'm sorry. I'm being a totally awful host. Here we are. We survived! I am going to count this as a win for the level, even though we are still hemorrhaging oxygen everywhere. We've got cracked dome, fractures everywhere. All three major domes are broken, and yet we are able to survive. We're replenishing our oxygen. We've only got 37 oxygen, so hopefully we don't have anything else cause us problems. We have our two sad little drones who have been destroyed. I wonder if I should just leave them there. I think we will leave them there. They're, that'll be their their funeral area or what do you call it? Grave. And we got our prefab. Yay! Okay, so let's get more fuel being created. As soon as that door opens, we'll have our fabs, and we can place one. Let's place it right Anomaly found. here. Now, we should be able to... Oh, we have the ability to build them. We just need more atmosphere, more water. We're almost to... Oh, we're at 7% water. That's cool. We're almost to, to being able to add grass. And... That's basically all we'll have. We'll be able to add grasses. <laughs> all that research. Yep. That's great. Okay. <gasps> we can build the next dome! Holy cow! Let's get rid of that. Uh, yeah. Oh, good! We've got it! 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 Oh, and you know what we can do? We also have enough money that we can buy that and speed things up. Close that. Sweet. Okay, and we have survive all the, uh, let's see. We need to get you going here and here and here. Sweet. I don't even know where he's going, but that guy is going off on an adventure. I think he's finally picking up the resources from here. Oh, that's so nice. I'm so glad they're finally picking up the resources. We'll follow him as he flies across our beautiful landscape. Reveals... I can't pan it up anymore, but oh, there it is. Sweet. He drops off a resource and he heads off onto his next mission. Oh, he's got to get refueled. Research complete. Sweet. Anomaly analyzed. Yes. Gene adaptation is good. So that means we can actually do more over here. Oh my gosh. We don't need that. Let's see. What are we doing? We are doing soybeans. We can do more over here. Which is really nice, because for these ones that are already at 100, or this one that's already at 100, we will stop doing soybeans after this, and we will allow it to... Let's change this to soybeans. Change that to seed crops. And this, I'm going to change to fruit trees, because look how much Sector you get. Scan. You have to wait longer for it, but you get a Anomaly lot. Analyzed. And as a result, like you can see, with just three, we can we can do pretty well. Let's uh, 
Let's just shrink that by one. This one's at 90%, so we can shrink that by one. This one's all the way open, so that we can get that one up above 50%. But, we've got transportation still. You're producing. Awesome. We are going to get the better hand on this. And, we're at 71%. Wow. I cannot describe how shocking that is, that we had such a bad catastrophe. And we have finally overcome it. We have one fracture left, apparently. See, you can see the oxygen leaking out. And it's probably driving these guys right, just downright down in their morale. MDS lasers came in handy. Research is done. Resources Ladies and gentlemen, done. we have made it. We can build a larger dome. And I love that position right there. We'll just stick it right out the front door of that barrel dome and color good although we have zero polymers <laughs> to be able to do this with that is so awesome uh, we're going to pause that because we do not need to use polymers until this is taken care of and <laughs> we are desperately trying to build this up, this is already built up we have no fuel Oh, this is just awesome one catastrophe after another. We are getting through this, though. If there is a way for us to make fuel, it will show up eventually. <laughs> oh, let's see here. We could probably kind of force this. We could put this one into play. And that will make things a little bit more... Uh, Effective. Oh, jeez. Dust storm approaching. Let's see. Rocket is going to analyze planetary anomaly. It is not getting fuel hardly at all. We've got another dust storm. We haven't even gotten very much water. Why? Why does this game hate us? Ah. <sighs> Let's take a break. We will see you next week. You guys have a wonderful day, and we will finish this dome next time. <sighs> have a good day.